Hey everybody and welcome back to Das Studio. In this video I'm going to talk about very quickly how to use level of detail principles to improve your performance. Before I get started, a huge thank you to everyone for subscribing and hitting that notification icon. That always helps me out. And of course an even bigger thank you to my members and patrons. Your names will be running across the bottom of the screen at the end of the video. So let's jump into this. This is essentially a really basic principle that's used in computer games in that if an object is further away from the camera, it doesn't require to have quite so much detail in its mesh and its textures. Now, whilst changing your textures in Dash Studio can be a bit of a faff unless you're using a third party plugin, we can work on level of detail principles with our models. Now, if you're using HD characters, what you'll probably find is that they are using quite a high level of subdivision. And subdivision, for those of you who don't know, is basically where a program will take the base mesh of an object or a character, and it will divide every single uh, line by two. It will place a vertex between each of the vertices that currently exist, thus doubling the complexity of the geometry now in the case of hd characters what you'll find is that generally speaking these will be created with using subdivision level 4 as a base point which is a huge amount of geometry which we don't necessarily need for example in this shot the character isn't very close to the camera it's a three-quarter shot so we can get away without using its hd uh, characteristics and what we can do with this character is we're going to select it in our scene like so and then we're going to go to in the parameters tab there is a a tab called mesh resolution and what you can see is that in our display we're at subdivision level one which means it's been subdivided once and we can drop that down to subdivision level zero and then that will immediately save us some memory in our viewport but what you'll also notice is that the subdivision level for rendering is currently set at 4. It was at 5 until I dropped the subdivision level there. Uh, but we don't need subdivision level 4 for this. We aren't going to use the HD features of this character for this shot because he's too far away from the character for them to be of any real consequence. So what we can actually do is we can go down to maybe subdivision level 2. And what this will do is it will reduce by a quarter, because it's halved and then halved again, the amount of uh, geometry memory that this particular character uses in our render. And that can, in a lot of cases, particularly in the current permutation of Dash Studio, be the difference between dumping to CPU rendering and staying on your GPU. So... This is a really, really useful thing to know, and a lot of people will obviously be aware of it already. But if you are struggling with your uh, CPU fallback, then this might be something to look into in reducing the number of subdivision levels in your render. And bear in mind that the characters already have a reasonable amount of subdivisions already, so you could go away with going to subdivision level 1, which is the default. Um, and that could make a significant amount of difference in your render times. Uh, anyway, thank you ever so much for watching that. Very quick tip. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Uh, I'm always keen to hear what you think. So, yeah, I'll see you next time. But until then, guys, take very good care of yourselves. Bye-bye.